Even as Singapore braces itself for the ASEAN Youth Games from the 29th of June onwards, preparations for the Youth Olympic Games are also underway. Senior Parliamentary Secretary Mr. Teo Sir Luck lets Razor TV in on how the selection process for the athletes is shaping up. Some of the sports, they have selected some of the initial group of athletes we train. Mm. And uh, the concept is that they have a uh, selection trial right now and they select an initial team. And they have a final selection trial next year to select the final team. Okay. So right now, there are some sports where the teams are more or less, uh, the initial teams are more or less ready and in training. Yeah, yeah like the table tennis and the football and some of these uh, sports have already had a youth development program. So they train them on the longer term. Mr. Teo said publicity for the YOG will only be ramped up after the AYG. However, he hopes that Singaporeans can be more involved in the event by being ambassadors. Yeah. And uh, I think they have a good chance to be ambassadors anytime during the games, you know why? Mm. Because the venues are just at our heartlands yeah. and uh, they're all over Singapore. So can you imagine they come down and go to coffee shop for breakfast and something? They may see a foreigner also having, having breakfast before they head up to the venues and the events. And mm. how do you handle them? What if they don't know the direction? Would they point to them and nicely, courteously and say that, oh, I bring you there and all that? So I think these are some things that we have to educate our citizens as well to let them take note. I think uh, Singaporeans are uh, generally very polite. Yeah. Uh, it's just that they are a little bit more reserved. But I think in time to come, when events are there, I believe they will rise to the occasion and help our foreigners. The inaugural Youth Olympic Games takes place next year from 14 to 26 August and is estimated to draw some 3,600 athletes and 500,000 spectators from around the world.